Hey, what's going on YouTube? It's just so you know it's best here. Here about to show you a very cool feature that comes on every Mac. It's called Back to My Mac. It's not a very new feature, but something I started to use lately a lot. And what it allows you to do to actually take control of your Mac no matter where you are in the world as long as you have an internet connection. So I'm going to show you how this works. So you do need um, two things. You need to have a mobile me account. So this does require a mobile me. And, uh, and all the Macs that you want to be able to share in uh, to take over and to have one, you know, one of your shared networks, you need to make sure you go to the system preferences panel of all of those Macs and go to the mobile me section. And then it'll have a back to my Mac section just like it looks here. And just make sure back to my Mac is turned on, indicated by that little green light there. And so once you do that, you can actually close this out. And just say, say for instance, right now I'm also I'm, I'm using my 27 inch iMac right now. But say I'm in North Dakota somewhere. I know that's random. <laughs> but say I'm in North Dakota somewhere, and I want to take control of this 24 inch iMac right here that I have back here in Missouri. I can simply open up Finder on my 27 inch iMac, and here in my share section, I'll see my MacBook Pro, my Time Capsule, and also my iMac. These are all devices I have connected with my mobile me account. And so I want to go ahead and take control of this iMac here. Go ahead and click on it and hit share screen. And what is this going to do? It's going to pop up screen sharing. I do have it remembered in my keychain, so I don't have to log in. Normally you have to log in, but I have it remembered. And so in a couple of seconds, it's going to pop up here. There it is. So this is the screen of my 24 inch iMac, but I'll also have my LED cinema display here. So that's why it's kind of wide screen. So this is on the left hand side here. It is my 24 inch iMac. So I do have this web page open, soldiernosbest.com. Definitely take a look at it. I'm live streaming all the time, uh, even right now. And, um, and so basically here it is. I'm taking control of my 24 inch iMac and I can move the uh, window over here if I wanted to. And this is my Ustream here. There's everybody in the chat room there. And um, basically, I can control this as, you know, as much as I want. So I can open up Finder here if I wanted to and look at any access, any files or get any documents or anything like that. And if I wanted to email something to myself, I can email it to me um, straight on this computer. So I'm here controlling it just like I'm actually there in person. So it works very well. It's very smooth, very seamless. And it doesn't take as many configuration settings to do it. Just, just do it and go. That's basically one of the things I love about it. And this also works on my MacBook Pro. So I got my MacBook Pro right here. I can choose to share the screen of that. And uh, so I use this a lot when I'm on my MacBook Pro to take control of my, my iMac when I'm at work or something like that. And so here's my very cluttered at the moment MacBook Pro. All my files right here. If I wanted to take a look at the files, I could take a look at some of the pictures there. I can use the keyboard and my mouse just like I would. There's a couple of pictures there. Nice little desktop background there. And so you kind of get the gist. So here I'm just sharing my screen on top of whatever Mac I am in the world. Very useful feature. I love it a lot. I'm going to be using it a lot here in the future. But this has been Soldier Knows Best. I want to give you a little heads up and a little hint there. But um, thanks for watching. Make sure you do check me out at SoldierKnowsBest.com. Watch a live stream. I am streaming a lot there, mostly 24 hours. And check in with us, drop it in the chat room, and drop a line and start talking with us. But thanks for watching. I will catch you later. Peace.